to have some fun with a little skit we did at Christmas there. It's a hillbilly kind of a song for when the relatives come up from Arkansas, the Clark family. <laughs> anyway, it's Hillbilly Robin Hood. Here we go. Well, I was sitting on the porch with my son one day And we were sampling some moonshine we just made And when we emptied that jug, Jethro said I bet that I can knock an apple off of your head And you can have my bow and arrow if I miss where I shoot You can have my wife and my hound dog too well, this hound finds coons near near every time. Wife's kind of ugly, but she cooks real fine. And most times that Jethro shoots real good. In fact, folks around here, they call him Robin Hood. So I thunk just one shot and that bow will be mine. I said, just one shot and that hound will be mine. Well, he missed that apple and he missed my head. He knocked the lid off a moonshine jug instead. Shucks, I opened another jug. Jethro said, we can't let her go to waste now, can we, Jed? So we emptied that jug. Jethro said, it's time to knock another lid or apple off of your head. Well, I was just a tad suspicious about his plan by then, so I kept my eyes open next time he took aim. Yes, he missed that apple and he missed my head, cause he were aiming at a moonshine jug instead. He turned to me with a grin and said, We's gonna have to drink some more of that moonshine jug. We finished that job, and acting too sane, said he'd like to shoot his bow and arrow again. But with all that drinking, he were quite the sight. He had one eye looking left, the other one right. So I should have said no, cause I could have been dead, but I let him use my double barrel shotgun instead. That weren't too smart. Well, he missed that apple and he missed my head. He knocked the lid off two of them jugs instead. And I said, boy, that there was a mighty fine shot. And we drunk them both down cause we was thirsty and hot. Yeah, we would have finished them off if we was thirsty or not. Well, we kept setting up jugs and just would shoot some more. One time he knocked a hole in the outhouse door. And Granny run out shouting, Who's shooting out there? We laughed, cause there was bum wife hanging down from her rear. But Granny weren't laughing, she were cursing instead. She hollered, Boy, I was gonna shoot that apple off of your head. But when that morning comes, you're gonna wake up dead. With shotgun made applesauce on top of your head. So I grabbed my gun and turned to Jethro and said, Son, you better take aim at finding your bed. And you can thank me in the morning if you wakes up live and not eating shotgun made applesauce on the other side. Yes, you can thank me in the morning if you don't wake up dead With shotgun made applesauce on top of your head Yeehaw! Down, 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 down,